Shepherd Mary Metal Metal Works. Okay. Of course. Let's do this the Big B way. Look around. All right. So this is where they've been sending these. Crooked man's gonna get it. He used Georgie to fucking cover up his tracks. Well, I'm gonna rip off his fucking limbs. Big Wolf. Who's that? The big bad wolf. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh! She's here. You used to be something. How lovely. How great. This is perfect. What else is that? I guess that's Lily. Yeah, that's Lily. When the fuck did we do this? Hey! That that was a moment. I swear to god I'm not cheating on snow. What what? What the fuck is this? When the fuck did this happen? Okay. They used to fear you. They'd hide anywhere their small shivering bodies would be. I like how Bigby's not giving a fuck what she's saying right now. <laughs> Bloody Mary, where the fuck are you? Silver! Oh, Jinx! What the fuck? Oh! How the fuck did you it's do that? Time you showed up. I had to take care of some things first. Little errand boy. That's nice. Oh. Uh, Bigby, I see you made it here in one piece. Oh. I apologize, yeah. but I have some business to attend to. I leave you in the capable hands of my associate. Come find me when you finish, dear. Don't worry. This won't take long. Get out of my way, now. Don't make this worse. Aw, he doesn't want to play. I'm sure you'll persuade him. <laughs> I'm not afraid to hit you! <laughs> oh, fuck. Wow, what a man. Stealing punches while my back is turned. Didn't your mother ever teach you to fight proper? Ow! <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> want something? I'll teach you how my mother taught me. Probably comes by the lights. Maybe. I. I thought she comes by. A fucking mirror. Cause it seems like she can somehow manipulate space. And time. Oh shit. <sighs> oh, you think her fast, huh? You think her fast. You think her fast, huh? That's a long way down. I mean, she could come right behind me and push me. Uh. This was a fucking bad idea. Oh! Oh! Who taught you how to fight, huh? Ow! Fuck. Where are you? 
enough games. Um. Oh, that. So fucking in it. What? Ah, oh, shit. Damn. That's one. Oh. oh, fucker. This is so fucking difficult. God damn. Bitch! Oh fuck. Oh! You know who you're fucking messing with? Ooh. Who are you fucking messing with? Who do you think you are? Bitch! Get fucked up! Oh ho ho! Ow! You, you, you don't know! Oh ho! Who's afraid of the big bad wolf now? Huh? Who's a fucking pussy now? What the fuck am I gonna do? Can I get bigger? Oh! I huff and I puff and I blow your ass! Bitch! <laughs> How do you fucking like that? Oh, you fucking pussy! What the hell are you gonna do? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck you, Mary! Fuck you, Mary! Told you. I to so he can turn back to normal. I knew it. He can turn back to normal. Oh fuck! I'm naked now. Damn. You like what you see, big boy? Mary's dead. It's just you, you fuck. Hello, Bigby. You look tired. Give me one good reason not to rip you apart right now. 
This gun holds six rounds of special. You think I give a shit? Oh. I won't miss next time. Before you do anything with me, I thought I should point out a few things. Snow White wants you to bring me back to the woodlands, doesn't she? And that's what I want. That's right. But what happens to you once you get there is a different story. I'm not quite finished. You will bring me back alive. Look, all I ask for is the chance to speak for myself in front of the community. And I'm sure Miss White would agree that I should be given a fair trial. Can we at least agree on that? I will have a trial. Are we clear? How about I bring your corpse back to the woodlands instead? You're not going to kill me. You bet your life on that? Look, there's no reason for us to be at each other's throats here. That's funny, coming from a guy pointing a gun at my head. This is just a precaution. I'm sure you understand. I'm no murderer, Mr. Wolf. I didn't kill those women. And I think you know that. All I'm asking for is a chance to explain Bullshit! the story. Bullshit! I already talked to Georgie. I know you ordered their deaths. Mr. Porgy is mistaken, I assure you. Fuck you! I'm a businessman, not a killer. There's still a lot you have to answer for. And I will, as long as you agree to my terms. Because I'm not saying another word until I'm brought before the community. And I don't think I'm being unreasonable. If you decide to do something stupid, like murder me, you won't get your answers. But you will have a difficult time explaining yourself to Miss White and the rest of this miserable town. You're often reckless, and I worry you're not thinking of the... Let me ask you an honest question. What do you really care about here? Getting laid! Do you really want the truth? Or do you just want to look like the hero? This is about protecting Fable Town. When some asshole murders two of our people, it's my job to bring them down. Then why are you here? You know who murdered them. Georgie. You are responsible. He's dead, isn't he? My point being, the killer has been dealt with. You've won. You really think I'm that stupid? I understand you have an obligation to bring me in. But you can brighten up a little. It's over. So, shall we get going? I'd rather not dawdle. You know, I'm actually looking forward to seeing Miss White again. Again? My previous interactions with her have gone rather well. All right, let's go. Hand over the gun. I think I'd rather hold on to it, if you don't mind. What do you say? Fine. Fine. I'm sure Miss White will be pleased. Such a reliable pup. I understand why she'd want to keep you around. Fuck! I broke your nose, motherfucker! Ha! You're under arrest. You'll be given a trial in front of your peers. <clears throat> And your punishment will follow. Crooked man has a crooked nose. I know, I know, but we have to do something. Are you fucking kidding me? When is this thing happening? Are we sure he's coming? Yes, you'll have an opportunity to. I got him, baby. The crooked man. Motherfucker. <laughs> that was funny. Are you okay? It's been hours. We were worried you'd run into some trouble. At the crooked man's place. Well, he didn't make it easy. What happened? It doesn't matter. He's here. We got him. We can talk about it later. You did well, Sheriff. I'm surprised. Not that you did well, but that, you know... I'm just... Glad you made it back in one piece. Kiss me, baby. It's about time you showed up. Now throw this asshole down the fucking well. Yes, what are you what waiting you for, you for murderer? Yourself? 
My you wife killed Lily. She was my sister. Where the fuck do you get you off? You think you have the right you to just do this to people? You You're a fucking Sir, crook. Yes. You should fucking be ashamed. Shit hole. Everyone, can I have your attention? Thank you all for coming here on such short notice. I know normally we'd schedule a formal hearing, but considering the circumstances, I thought it best if we do this as soon as possible. The crooked man is charged with the murder as of I Faith and- As I already informed your sheriff, it was Mr. Georgie Porgy who killed those women, not me. What? It was Georgie? Georgie? I don't mean to interrupt you, Miss White. Georgie may have killed them, but you made the call. Do I have to explain the situation to you again? Wait a minute. So you're saying Georgie's the motherfucker who killed my sister? Well, where is he? Yeah, you're gonna bring that shithead in too, aren't you? Yes, yeah, Sheriff. Where is that rotten scoundrel now? Is he still out there? I sincerely hope not. Well, where is he? Sheriff? Don't worry about it. It's done. Justice has already been dispatched. Bigby executed him. He's... what? Dead. So you see, the culprit has been punished. There's no That need doesn't change this. anything. We'll deal with it later, but right now you're the one I'm concerned with. You called the shots. Georgie made that perfectly clear. In which case, you still have a lot to answer for. I and was I told don't... I would be allowed to speak. We have to read the rest of the charges. What other charges? If you'd wait a moment. Let her finish. Then you can have your say. Got it? Mm. If you insist. <clears throat> you are charged with the murder of Faith and Lily, which Georgie carried out on your order, inciting violence against various members of the Fable Town community, including the attempted murder of Sheriff Bigby Wolf. Twice. A misunderstanding. Aiding Bullshit. and providing monetary support for the forced prostitution at the Pudding and Pie. Additionally, you are charged with multiple counts of fraud, extortion, racketeering, and the illegal possession and sale of magical artifacts. And resisting arrest. Oh, yes. Now is there anything you would like to say? <clears throat> First of all, I had nothing to do with Faith and Lily, so you can strike that one from your little record book. Bullshit! Second, like hell you did Stop the charade. We know you're in- I know you're responsible. You've been behind all of this from the beginning, so cut the shit. We all know who you are. We know what you've Just done. Just give it up already. The Crooked Man has committed crimes against this government, and most importantly, its citizens. These charges, if proven, are enough to justify death, upon which your body will be committed to the witching Where realm. it fucking belongs! That's so right. let's get on but with it, But we promised you a chance to defend yourself. And I won't rob you of that right. What the You're fuck? Really this is about talk? justice. If we're ever going to pull ourselves together and make something of this town, we have to start doing things correctly. No more snap judgments, no more secrets. We are going to treat everyone fairly, even when they don't deserve it. This is ridiculous. You have the floor. Motherfucker. Thank you, Miss White. You've all met Georgie. I don't have to tell you what kind of person he was. He was a total scoundrel, lacking in any sort of moral fiber. I hired him as a favor to his family, you see. A promise kept to a dying mother. Oh, Are you gonna get to your point or what? Georgie was working for me, yes. But he was not acting on my behalf when he killed those women. It was his business. And for whatever reason, I'm sure only he could understand, he murdered two of his most faithful employees. I had nothing to do with Tell it. This is such bullshit! You have always been a bit of a powder keg. Give me a break. You're so full of shit. Well, I thought we could discuss this like civilized people, but apparently for that isn't going sake. to happen. Any of you actually believe this bullshit? No! Holly, please. Tell them, Bigby. When you finally showed up at my door last night, wasn't I more than helpful? I answered your questions. I was willing to cooperate. What's he talking about? Yeah, and your goons attacked me. Did you forget that part? They get a bit carried away sometimes, it's true. Loyal to the end. They do it because they want to protect me, as I protected them. You understand wanting to protect what you care about, don't you? You'd do anything. You might even give up an innocent man, just to save someone. 
What's he talking about? I think you're done talking. What are you afraid of? Why not let an old man say his piece? Let me explain this to you. My employees are just that, hired help. I see some of them are here among you. They are not my slaves. They are all free to make their own decisions, as Georgie was. You're not serious! I know what you do to people, I've seen it firsthand! What you did to Faith, the way you manipulated her! Do you really think any of those girls were free? Do you really think Faith I'm wanted sorry, to- I'm sorry, Lawrence. I'm sorry that your wife came to me for help, and I'm sorry that I decided against my best judgment to give her a distasteful job. Right, and you kept them in debt so they couldn't leave. Yeah. You That's fuck. what you did to us. How you kept us all you in You forget line. it was not me who put you in that position. You all act like I'm some kind of tyrant. When your government abandoned you, left you poor and helpless, sniveling on street corners, I was there to look out for you. Yes, but... Wasn't I? We didn't abandon anyone. We've been trying to help them. Really? Yeah. What about Archie Greenleaf? Her story is not uncommon. She left everything she had back in the homelands. Everything that matters, anyway. With nowhere else to turn, she came to me for help. And what did I do for you? Come on, Greenleaf. You got my tree back. I got her tree back. And in turn, we used her magic to help poor Fables get glamours. Because I helped her, she was able to make a living, provide for herself. And what did they do? She wanted my tree destroyed, but Bigby refused. What? You were gonna burn her tree? Snow, why would you want that? Don't blame Snow, she had her reasons. Greenleaf was using her magic to help Crane and the Crooked Man. That's why Snow wanted your tree burned. That's not why. It wasn't her fault. You can lie to yourself, but you can't lie to me. You hated Crane, and you hated him for wanting to fuck you, and you being too soft to notice what he'd do to get. It had nothing to do with a crooked man. We've made some mistakes. I've made some mistakes. But believe me, I truly want what's best for this town. And that may not always be clear right away. But I want you all to know that I care deeply about all of you. And so does the sheriff. Ah, yeah. I, I, I a good. promise you perfection. I couldn't give no two shits can. about any of you. But I can promise to always have your best interests at heart. Like you did with her? Maybe you haven't noticed, but we've been doing all this to protect you. We're trying to stop people like him. The crooked man's been exploiting you. Exploiting your hope for a better life. You would go to him for help, and he would take that weakness and add it to his strength. And if things didn't fall exactly his way, someone would die. We're not gonna tolerate this shit anymore. The debts are wiped. His business is closed. He's done. They're right. Yeah! You're all still afraid of him, even now. But you needn't be. His contamination of this town is over. Yeah! Those girls will have their justice. Yeah! Fuck yeah! Fuck you, crooked man! <laughs>